Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. Uh, my name is Mike, uh, aka The Strategist, and today I'm gonna show you how to format a portable USB SSD hard drive to work with CDJs. Uh, this video is aimed at Windows users, so let's get down to it. This is my unit, it's a 500 gigabyte uh, SanDisk Extreme Portable SSD. Uh, it's pretty good, good price. Anyway, let's do it. Okay, so the first thing you wanna do is go to Google and search Mini Tool Partition Wizard. Um, what we gotta do is we have to change the drive type and then we have to format the drive. So there's two things we gotta do and the like stock Windows thing doesn't, doesn't do that. So go here, click the button, click download and install. Uh, once you do that, um, then, you know, play the video from this spot. So when you do that, you will see this, this come up. This is what the mini tool partition wizard looks like. Um, I have my drive plugged in already. So let's give you a quick breakdown of what, what we're looking at here. Um, we are looking at, uh, disc one and disc two. Disc one is the hard drive in my computer. Uh, I don't want to touch that. That's, that's just the way it is. I like my stuff, so let's not delete it all. Uh, disk 2, however, this is the SanDisk Extreme, the, the thing that I showed you a couple seconds ago, and it has 500 gigabytes. Don't worry that it's not actually showing 500 gigabytes. That's just how shit works. So what we got to do is first we have to change the drive type. If you look down here in the bottom left where my cursor is, you'll see that this says MBR. That's good. That means that it's the correct drive type because I've already formatted it. Uh, but notice here, just for comparison's sake, uh, disk one above it, my hard drive, it says GPT. Uh, that's the like common one. But for some reason, you know, Pioneer CDJs don't like that. So you have to change it to MBR. So how do you do that? Um, you just right click the drive and say convert. So it's telling me here, convert it from the good one to the bad one, but I'm not going to do that. What will what you will see uh, if it is GPT, the wrong one, uh, you'll see convert GPT to MBR. So do that. Click the button and then hit apply. So anything, any changes you make to a drive in this program, you have to apply them. Uh, don't forget that. Otherwise, you'd be like, why doesn't this work? And yeah, that's why. So do that. Uh, also, you have to make sure that there is only one partition. So see here on this disk one, there are five different thingies here. Um, for the use of external hard drives on CDJs, that's going to confuse it. And it doesn't like that. It's just not going to work. So you can only have one. Okay. So if you see any others, just delete them. You just like, you know, right click, delete boom, 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 then change the drive type and you'll be, you'll be good to go. Um, so the second thing you need to do is you need to change the, the file system to FAT32. This is kind of an older system and it's, it's got some problems, but this is why we're using the, the program that we're using because we can kind of cheat it a little bit. So yeah, change that. Click the right, click it. Click format, click FAT32, apply, bingo, bango. That's what you do. Uh, yeah, <laughs> that's the whole thing. So next you'll want to, you know, open up Rekordbox and see if your Rekordbox will recognize it, which, which it should, uh, just like any other USB. Uh, if you have any comments or questions or concerns or anything, please put them in the comments below and I'll do my best to get back to you as soon as possible. Anyways, happy mixing.